to just tell us what to you, what does this mean? Gift profitability. Uh, I'm of the strong belief that uh, no one is on earth by accident. Uh, we're on earth for a purpose. And that purpose, interestingly, it's never about us. It's a selfless purpose. It's all about God. I'm a person of faith. So uh, you need to have that understanding to truly appreciate and understand what this session is about. Now, the person for which or who we're here on earth has put us here for a purpose. And the sooner one finds a purpose, the better. Because you can't be truly fulfilled or successful or happy until you found that purpose. And the way that purpose is exercised is through the gift or giftings that is unique to each individual. The challenge or most of the time is we tend to desire the gift or gifting of somebody else rather than find what ours is. I worked in the banking industry for 19 years until 2006, and I actually rose to a general manager position, which is just two levels beneath being the managing director of a financial institution. So I rose to the peak of my career, but I was never happy or fulfilled until I discovered my purpose, one of my giftings, which basically is to enhance people's capacities and to show them that you can aspire and live a fulfilled life. But that starts when you find your purpose. It's what actually led me to write my fifth book, What Is That in Your Hands? A Discovery of Purpose. So we all have gifts. The challenge is some have one, some have two, some have five. But guess what? The fulfillment once we find it, for the person who has only one gift, it's exactly the same as that that has four or five. So, and uh, I believe in the course of this program, I would be able to share with whoever may have that challenge in either discovering or reaffirming the gifts that they're endowed with. So I left banking after 19 years when I found out that this is not it. The pay was fantastic. The benefits were great. And for 16 years, I've been following my purpose. It's, I'm sure it's part of why Dr. Famuya must have stumbled on me somewhere and invited me to be here. He had seen the exercise of my gifts and my giftings, which is manifested in the entrepreneurial space and in the leadership space with visible, physical, measurable results to prove. So I'm not as... Uh, financially comfort rich not com I'm comfortable but I don't have enough uh, financial resources as I would have had if I had stayed in the banking industry but I'm a lot more fulfilled I'm a lot more impactful and I mean I'm 58 years old in about two months time but if I was to tell you I'm in my 30s or 40s you won't argue that comes from finding your gifting and living on purpose <laughs>